Stop. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, I want to just. Uh, please give me the option to stab this dude in the back, bro. Yo, I just. I just. Oof. I just started watching Attack on Titan again. And I just saw the, the episode where Aaron Yeager. It, it's a lot of play. Young, young one. Looks like a tornado oh, so, through here. Save. Yeah, well, I'm supposed Mikasa. to be doing the dishes. You know, you know. Just passing through. That's what I want to do right now. All right. Yeah, this Previously on The Walking Dead. I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about coal. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! I'm fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way! Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you! No! We have to go! You could have saved him! How could you just leave him? Welcome back to another episode of the Walking Dead Hotel series. Episode 2. Grab your snacks! What the hell? I did say find something. That was kind of poor judgment. Hey, Clip kind of strong. Follow me. Pete got bit. What? He got bit. He wasn't going to make it. I ranted about this in the first episode what if you missed it. Do now? <laughs> I don't care. If we're stuck here, we should at least look around. Maybe we can find something to help us get out of here. Knock yourself out. Damn, bro, you just gonna give up? Brett. Kenny Jr., bro. Moonshine. It's a still. I know what it is. The fuck you do. Okay, Damn, bro. what Rude. then? It's for making booze. But that rig ain't fit to piss in. Rude that. What is that stuff? Let me see. I think you're extra drunk. 
Make a drink off the whiff. Whiskey. Now what? Oh, oh fuck if I know. Kenny Jr. We wait, wait I guess. Our lives that de is dependent on a crate of apples, right? Surprisingly works. Bruh. Oh my god, bro. And like a goddamn child. I had to kill my mom. I didn't ask you that. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on it. His big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that everyone I grew up with it all happened to them now it's gonna happen to us we're all so fucked this whole world is fucked we'll make it bullshit I mean what's the point We'll just march to some new place and somebody else will die. It's never gonna stop. Eventually, it'll be our turn. I can't believe we've been here a day. A day. It's been a day, right? No. Two hours. Hey, kid. No! Have a drink with me. No, thanks. This shit will kill her. Listen. They're not coming for us. You should go. Run for it. What, what are you gonna do? Stay here. I'm tired. Go find Luke and the rest. They'll take care of you. They're good people. I knew someone like you. He was always screwing up too. Screwing I didn't, up? I didn't think she was saying I didn't ask for any <laughs> of this. Nobody does. So what? You know what? I kind of like aggressive Clem. Come with me. Are you kidding? And leave all this? You can't just sit here and die. Why not? What does it matter? You still have Luke and everyone else. They're family. Nick, I need your help. Please. You're right. Oh. Yeah. Now look, if we get separated, cabin's only half a mile from here. You can't miss it. What direction? You ready? Are you ready? <laughs> Fuck it. Save him, I'm gonna try my best, I'll be honest. Hey, over here! Come on, okay. you fucks! Never Look mind. at me! Get himself. Get the fuck out of here! I said get the fuck out of here! 
See, I tried. Damn. Easy, huh? Truck one zombie, weaved another. Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you? Where's Alvin? What happened? You spent hours. Where are they? Clem! We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus! Pete got killed. I was with Nick, but... My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there! Get the guns! Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. She gets nervous. Just go. Hurry. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And I got it. We gotta stop like treating this as if it's Say some fairy tale. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. Take Oops. <laughs> Why'd you start talking? I guess it didn't catch. <laughs> What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Clem, you're scaring me. He'll be fine. Are you sure? She didn't believe it. Sorry, I, I, I just need to... She kind of jumped to conclusions fast, huh? You want to see what I found? Will you show me how to what use What the fuck? It? Uh, I couldn't find any bullets. Oh, shit. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? Nobody tells me anything. It's too dangerous. Uh, everything is dangerous. I need to know I'm sometime. not the one that should you decide should this. You should let your dad teach you. Really? Like, oh, What she's... should I shoot? Nothing. Don't do that. Sorry, sorry. Maybe I could practice outside. No. There's that tree. Hey, Luke's back. The fact that I didn't see kind of has got me worried. I should run. That's not Luke, is it? Nothing. I, I didn't get to see your perspective. Ah. Ah. Why am I moving so slow? Who the hell? That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Where? 
Upstairs. Oh. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. Shh. Upstairs. Hello. What is this bar? Anybody home? What the fuck? Hello there. Get out of here now. Is that how your dad taught you to greet a neighbor? Yes. I've got a gun. A smart girl. I would too. But I'm not a bad guy, honey. Promise you that. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? What's your name? <laughs> My name is George, honey. Pleasure to meet you. You mind if I come in for a No, bit? what the fuck? I've been out all morning and this heat has got me cooked. Would you please leave? This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Sure could pack a lot of folks in there. Just me and and dad. Yeah? What's his name? I w Ed. shut up! Strong name. I oh like him God. already. <laughs> you should've gave him he? He's out. Why are well, you- I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them to be- exact. Get out the house! Oh They've my God. Oh, while and <laughs> oh. Have gotten lost. oh boy. Maybe you've seen Oh him. man. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big oh. black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. That's a lot of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. Bro, can you stop? Oh my god. Oh. Oh, I want to just. Uh, uh, please give me the option to stab this dude in the back, bro. Yo, I just. I just. Oof. I just started watching Attack on Titan again. And I just saw the, the episode. Rare Niger. It, it's a lot of places. Young, people. young one. Looks like a tornado oh, so through here. Save. Yeah, well, I'm supposed Mikasa. to be doing the dishes. You know, you know. Just passing through. That's what I want to do right now. While. All right. Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. And I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Hell, I just got here and I already don't want to leave. Where do you live? Yeah, down by the river there. There's a sweet little spot with a boat where we pitched camp. I just feel like he's gonna up go straight else. for that fucking. Like I said, I'm surprised we haven't run into each other. Do you have a dog? No, I don't. What difference does it make? Just wondering. <laughs> really, bro? Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer there. Just a bunch of spoons. <laughs> it's like, oh. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Can you stop walking through this damn house, bro? Well, it's a real nice place. Kind of cozy. It's my place. Leave. <laughs> this got me antsy, bro. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Bro, why do you know this Doctor. detail? Real smug, son of a bitch. I don't care. You know, you're really not very polite for a little girl. And you're not very polite for an adult. This is my house. Fair point. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? Fucking dead, dumbass. Why'd you shrug? I thought you said nobody's here. Did I not just say my dad was here? Oh, I tried to click it. What? Why are you in my house with a gun out? Why are you? What? What is? What is? 
What is your deal? Who just comes to somebody's house and decides to fucking I told you, no search and clear. search and clear, bro. Right? That way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. Like you. Right. You, if you decide to. What they call the tie issue. What was that? Who's this? My sister. She's dead. Really? Well. I'm very sorry to hear that. Thanks. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. Gonna I lie to myself out. Don't come back. You have a real good day now. Please go out the door. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? Damn, I should yeah, if I didn't take that photo. It's crazy how this game works. We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Clementine. Sarah. You were with Nick, right? We gotta go find him. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? No! Calm down, Rebecca. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. He said his name was George. George? That's what he said. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? He had a big brown coat. Did it have a lining? A collar? Yeah, fur. <laughs> talked about I look, he Dad. wasn't looking at that. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. All right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? Hell yeah. He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. I took the picture. It's my fault. No, I asked her to. It's my fault. Sarah. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. Look, we gotta find Nick on our way out of here. You know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Where are the chances that we find Nick? Usually when you don't see a body, you're most likely alive. Now you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. 
I bet it's you are. It's just a tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. You need to stop bossing me around. This hasn't been easy on me, but I'm trying, Clem. I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Alvin and I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Any ideas? <laughs> he just walks away. <laughs> oh, man. Me and Clem are the same. There. <laughs> That's where we were. Can I get a damn weapon? Nick! Man got drunk again. Get the door. Jesus. <laughs> Drunk as fuck. Hey, man. You got any aspirin? Nick, you asshole. Pete's dead. I know, man, I do. We gotta get moving. Okay, Carver's gang showed up. Can you make it? Yeah. Yeah. Good, let's go. Clem, uh, I just wanted to say thanks for not giving up on me. Next time you should listen to me. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really liking the cold approach from Clem, bro. <laughs> what happened back there in that cellar? Did he do something stupid? Nick, he can tell me. I'm just looking out for him. Nick saved my life. Really? Yeah, sort of. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You sure you still want to come with us? Have to, no. Look, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher. I don't have anywhere else to go. Well then, welcome to the party. Yeah, thanks. We're, uh, we're smarter than we look. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. Boy, about that, the worst hangover of his life. See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. We've got to find some shelter. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. Ski resort? Here, eat this back. But we're almost out of food. We gotta save it. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? It must be that ski resort. I've... Never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. No snow. Why is there an echo? There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. There's the bridge. 
And does it look passable? I think so. Good. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. Bruh. She's a valuable little girl. I mean, hell, if she can sew up her own arm, she's fit to cross a bridge. I can do and it. And I can shoot. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay can with you? the group. Oh, I'm it is. Fine, it dude. has been five days. I don't like this. Oh, days yeah, is enough well, to sober. Last time you liked anything, Carlos. If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Damn, he's disappointed. Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just I could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. They're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? Can you, can you stop being around what the bush? What does everyone want? Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? Seems like we're already in the middle of it. Tell me about it. Hmm. Light work. Can't shoot them. Too much noise. But there are only two. Let's take them. I like your style. Me a knife. A knife. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. We should be okay. I think. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. The echo's gonna alert them. What? Do, what? Still got the camera. <laughs> kind of a surprise. Not gonna lie. Go ahead. Give it a good pull. It should come free. Where's this echo? Know. I've done this before, remember? <laughs> In a shed. <laughs> nice work, kid. <laughs> Ow. Kidding. Let's see that sun. Some sun rays. Something better than a, a hammer, man. Shit. What the fuck? 
Am I tripping? My first death of season two. Bruh, I was... There must be something else I gotta do. I'm okay. I just... I'm stuck. I can't reach. It's okay. Clem, look. We'll, we'll figure something out. Behind you! Oh, shit. Are you the back up? Bruh. What? Kind of annoying. Broke it. What the fuck? Clem! <laughs> I'm not liking this option, bro. What the fuck, bro? Yeah, give me that mach machete. Swing! Okay, it's like only showing up when you're... I'm just spamming the clicks, bro. Fuck. Fuck it. It's not the brain. I dropped the machete. I thought I was using that to hook you up. Thanks, Clem. You're welcome. Let's keep going. see him yeah just play it cool and you do the talking what why me I don't want to get in a fight you really think he chewed a little girl just don't make any sudden might. moves and don't piss him off I'd shoot me well that's a hell of a thing to say <laughs> I'm just saying well if it comes to that I'll shoot him first That'll be quick on the draw. Well, who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. Wanna help me out here? I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. Now, why are you so comfortable walking in the middle? This is the weirdest. Huh. You don't look like assholes. Right. Are you assholes? Let's see. No offense or anything, but you know how it is out here. You're the one holding a gun. Touche. You folks headed north like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. You all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Do you know Carver? Carver? Like George Washington Carver? The peanut guy? What? He's a man. Never heard of him. But no, I want some peanut butter, though. I gotta say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's, uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right, then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? What are you doing? No, 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 he's, he's with us. Nick! No! Don't shoot! What the f... <laughs> Bro, what kind of... Did I hit him? Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? 
Who was that guy? Why didn't you wait for a signal? Why did you shoot? He pointed a gun at me. Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. That was the dumbest thing that I've ever seen somebody do. He was not... I'm lagging. Sorry. He was not holding us hostage. He didn't have the gun pointed at us. Who the fuck was that back there? And Nick came know. running up Looked guns like blazing. Gun. Of course he's going. Me. He doesn't he know who you are. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man. He drew first. Well, that's not what it looked like to me. Shut up, Nick. I'm sorry. That uh, I that was what ruthless. Did you see, Clem? Was that guy going to shoot? No, Fuck you, he Luke. wasn't. You've been on my case the whole week. And why do you think that is, Nick? He wasn't going to do anything. I know what I saw. Oh. Either way, I, I got to be honest, bro. I got to be honest. Yeah, but I didn't. To be fair, I didn't know. I, I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but do. you can't don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? No. No, I... No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Luke, can I talk to you alone? Bro, don't don't just come snapping at me, bro. Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Beck's dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we can spend the night here. A little small for us, though. You could use a little downsizing. You're one to talk. Sure. Thanks, Clem. You know, this is this is one of those moments where me personally, I'd, I'd be thinking to myself, why the hell am I with this group? I'm about to steal this axe, bro. I need that axe, bro. Give me that axe. Y'all got it. Y'all got it in the screen, bro. I, I have to be able to grab it. Thanks a lot for backing me up there. What you want me to do, lie? I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Look, he's becoming a danger to the group. So who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. He was just a guy. Yeah. If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. My... You know... I'm hungry. He reminds me. Anyway? Damn. Goddamn Angela. Damn. What's wrong? I left my watch back at the cabin. Especially in season. It was Pete's. Or two. He gave it to me. It was all I had left of him. You know what? I'm gonna go talk to them. How she, how she like shot Daryl in the ear thinking that Daryl was a goddamn zombie. Goddamn Walker. I want that damn axe, bro. I'm just saying. Shoot first, ask questions never. Be that axe. Sorry, yellow. Yeah, bro. Welcome to a trip mine. I like that the damn ambiance noise. I guess he slept here. It's dead. So take that. Please don't drop it. <laughs> Feels pretty good. Especially over bridge.
feel like if I try prying this thing open, it's gonna break. The man said he had lots of food. There's gotta be something left. And if this damn, if this damn box breaks my knife, I'm gonna be highly upset. What was that? Big ass knife. Say. Is that a, is that a Lord of the Rings? Show not pass. Man, not thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. Give him a break. His uncle just died. Yeah, true enough. I don't know what I'd do if I lost Beck. I'm just saying. I mean, you ever know anyone to do a thing like that? Lots of people. It happens all the time now. It's fucking crazy. Pardon my French. That's funny. She looks just like you. Oh, she don't? Hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group, but I've got to put Beck and the baby first. I won't lie for you. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have put you in that position. Yeah, it's a shame. This, this... Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. You've only knowing me for He's four just days. Losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us. Oh, it's been time. more than that. The hell is that? Oh, what is it? Walkers. We got a problem here. Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. Find anything in that shed? Why didn't I get the axe? It's another weapon we could have had, man. Fuck that. Well, what are we waiting for? We have to be careful. Careful? We've been on the road for five days. My back is done being careful. <laughs> it doesn't look like anybody's home. Tight. Damn. Nailed down tight. I'll check where I had the hammer. I'll go with you. Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there. Probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? Sure. That'd be just like climbing a treehouse. I had a treehouse once. Well, there you go. <laughs> Am I a monkey? <laughs> I hated it. Oh. Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. Got a good grip? Yeah. yeah. When I was a kid, it's... we used to jump rooftops downtown. It's just a now ladder. that was fun. That sounds stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. <gasps> whoa, whoa, whoa. You're fine. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're, you're fine. You said don't look right, down. Just, just slow down. Just for a second, okay? Keep your voice down. But you just yelled at me. Shut up. <laughs> you gotta give in to the angsty team. Is the group lags. Made it. See anything? 
I can see the bridge. Oh. Wait, I see something. What is it? A light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Luke. You gotta do the Gears of War slide. They not hear me yelling at me. Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, oh. but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone, calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please, just do what he says. What the fuck? Kenny. Wait, you know this guy? What the fuck? Time. I got two of them now. It's not a good thing. This is a good thing, but not the other Kenny. Sorry. I'll take that as a How? Oh, you know what? I just These said it. With you? If we didn't see a body, they didn't die. Look at that. We can talk inside. I'll be honest, I wasn't Great. expecting this. I just started dinner. What the fuck? Are you sure you don't mind? <laughs> it's gonna storm soon. Please, come in. What kind of reunion? That's insane. You look just like this other guy. Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so Sarita. we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. What's funny? Oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. You're our guests here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down then. Kenny? Will you vouch for these people, Clem? I'm spitting image. But... <laughs> if you tell me they're good, then I'm good. Us. You were the one waving a gun around, man. We're cool, okay? Hey, hey, we're cool. We're cool. I can't speak for everyone. I'm be honest, bro. I, I'm trying to be as honest Back, it's their as home. possible. We're not going to find another place like this tonight. I might be a little cold-hearted. My, my real life self right Dad, now. look. A Christmas tree. Not now, Sarah. Isn't it great? We found it all in storage. It's amazing. These damn ocean faces. Let's be honest, I can't speak for for, for Nick. But I'll be honest. The dude done already shot a random innocent person. <laughs> so. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. It's so weird. What if this actually isn't Kenny? <laughs> well, how'd you get out? Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know?
He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. Hell. He was a hell of a guy. When my son, well, he helped me do the right thing. I'll never forget that. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. Omid, well... Krista and I were together for a while, but these guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm they still sorry, never darling. explained the babies. I wish I could have found you sooner. But everything's gonna be fine now. Where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. How did you get out of there? Krista got in a hell of a mess. I gave her a hand and then it got messier. For a minute there, oh, that's right. it was looking know too good that... for old Kenny. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It's it, uh... Uh -oh. And then I met Sarita. Thank God. Joe Biden. Gosh, here. it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Clem, this is my girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? Hey, Clementine. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? So how do you know Kenny? <laughs> he and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. It's a long story. Very long story. By the Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. Guarantee you there's enough sodium in those beans. Everyone underestimates me. I expect you've used that to your advantage. I looked down and saw how fast Sometimes. the bar was going. I was like, what the? <laughs> Smart girl. Depend. <laughs> mm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? Looks great. It looks like mush. No, it doesn't. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. As an artist, there's nothing I like less than a friendly critic. Huh. Striking resemblance. Anyway, I'll take it from here. Cousin Jared's concert, October 13th, 1998. Reminds me of school. I was gonna play it, but I, my first thought was, hey, turn that sound off. Loudspeakers come on or some shit. Or I haven't seen one of these since. What's this song you're humming? Good King Wenceslas. It's my favorite Christmas song. <laughs> What's it about? <laughs> well, it's about a king that brings food to a poor man. The king and his servant march all night through a cold winter storm to reach the man. The storm is very strong. After a long time, it gets so cold that the servant can't go what on. A funny little but guy. the king tells the servant to just step in his tracks. 
Mark my footsteps, scoot my page, tread thou in them boldly. Thou shalt find the winter's rage, freeze thy blood less coldly. I don't get it. <laughs> it means that doing good things for people can be good for you too. But the servant wouldn't have been out there in the first place if the king hadn't made him. <laughs> good point. Crazy. Why would they follow us this far? We can't be sure. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. We can't be sure. They might be tracking us. Tracking? Who do you think they are? Ninjas? Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. People? <laughs> Way down there. How? She's got binoculars, genius. I saw lights. Which way did they go? Back into the woods. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We have to be careful. We mostly talked about Kenny. Kenny is the loud man with the beard? Yeah, that's him. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. Honey, I, I don't feel so good. Beck, what's wrong? I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. Where is he holding? Are you okay? I have a lighter. Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I mean, how can anyone now? Everything's so fucked up. I think it's possible. How do you know? Look at me. Well, I'm still here. I know it's gonna be hard, but at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. She's Didn't kicking. Care about me? Want to listen? That food smells good, Gross. Huh? <laughs> it's okay. I Gross. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it is, isn't it? You know, the wholesome thing would have been, yeah, that's, can I? <laughs> it's not his. Oh, shit. Well, why are you telling me this? <laughs> I trust you for some reason. And I can tell you kept a few secrets. Alvin finds out he'll kill. I hate keeping secrets, man. I don't know what to do. First chance I get, I'm a stool I can't pigeon. I I'm asking a little girl for advice. But I guess nothing's weird anymore. I I don't know what to say. I should have kept it. There's my man. You all right, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. I just need to get some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Claire. So whose is it? Who who's would it? You ask that Walter guy when we're gonna eat. Yeah, that's the real question. Who, I who's with it? Because if they're, I hate it when you call me that. If they're in the group still, I know that's I gonna mean. be weird. I love you too. You get some rest now. Oh, we already had the situation. That that. Wait, what did he ask me to do? <laughs> I was paying attention. He said something. He said something about Walter. What the? Fuck? I'm stuck. And I ain't cutting shit. Y'all gonna, y'all gonna. Clem, we could use some help. Watch everything I do. Hey, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well, he's so different now. But you must be so glad. So, how'd you meet Kenny? I found him holed up in an old restaurant, if you can believe it. Hold up? You should have seen his beard then. Perfect. Now we just need the topper. 
We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. Damn mission with this guy. I was gonna have the option to take it. Guess not. <laughs> Why did I look guilty looking? <laughs> Back upstairs. I feel like they gave me a mission to do. Going back. Oh. Oh, perfect. That's nice, I guess. Beautiful. Uh, I used to Bleh. love this time of year. Bleh. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting oh, to feel like Oh, these decisions, bro. Like, every decision I make is just... Is... Matthew and Walter are amazing people. I just turned Honestly, Sarah into a goddamn villain. Kind, but they can't help it. Wait, Wait until you meet Matthew. Angel. He's a real character. The first time he met me, he called me Rita. So I call him Maddie now. It's kind of our little war. Where is Matthew? Oh, he likes to go on long walks. He and Walter used to vacation here. He should be back soon. Long walks Clem, by himself? I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? Huh? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. He has good days and bad days like everyone else. Yeah, there's only but lately I seconds. get the feeling he's struggling. He seems like the same old Kenny to me. Oh, well, that's good. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny, <laughs> he's always great. been like this. I got it, hon. I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Yeah, he's always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. Well, everyone, dinner is served. Come on, let's eat. Well, Alvin's got peaches. Okay, yeah, just it's hiding peaches in I this wish bag. I that trigger. Just try to forget about it. Right here, Clem. Made me choose. What kind of damn school lunch shit is this? I feel like this. I feel like I've seen this in so many movies too. This is like, this is like a tide turner right here, bro. I'm gonna pick a seat, right? And it's gonna make people. It's gonna make the other side look at me in a completely different way. Here's the thing, right? I know Kenny personally, right? And I know that, like, the, the storyline isn't going to be, oh, I just want to catch up with Kenny because right, it's been mad long, right? The storyline is going to be choosing him over us. We saved your life. You've been with us this whole time. For the last week. <laughs> but, bruh, I don't like this, bruh. That's giving me too much pressure. That's giving Clem too much pressure. I mean, if we if we look at law of average, right? I got five people on this table. Three. I might as well like slightly like, even it out. That's so weird. Oh, go, Clem. The, the emotions, Bruh. So Clem, we were just talking. What's the deal with the kid? And what's his name? Luke. He in charge. You trust him? Jesus 
Candy, please. Sarita, we don't know these folks. They seem nice. Yeah. I like him. He's a good guy. Would you trust him with your life? He's ear hustling right now, man. What's I it think like? so. It's like. Or you see how straight neck he is? He's ear hustling. He's doing this. He said they were on the run. Some people are after them. Well, you don't have to worry about that no more. They'll go tomorrow and you can stay here. Absolutely. Oh. Honey, you stay with us as long as you want. She's staying for good. If that's what she wants. Of course she does. Right, Clem? I don't know what I want. Everybody just swaps places. <laughs> 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 I wasn't expecting that. Did we actually just why did y'all do that? <laughs> hey there. Why are y'all over hey. here? <laughs> Hope you like the food. Oh, it's it's great. Thank I'm you. so confused. Beaches and beans. <laughs> great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out though, I tell ya. <laughs> so it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Wellington? The hell is that? A place. Yeah. Krista and I were going there. It's supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land, and cold-ass winter so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, Vanilla Ice, I don't know what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. That'd be just fine by me. Uh... What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying. Please, don't fight. Gentlemen, please, there's no need for this. Now look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. Pass me that can, duck. Duck? Damn. Duck? Who's duck? Leave him alone, Luke. Hey, Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? I kind of feel like it's safer for me to be here. <laughs> Just in case I have to mediate a fight, you know? Jesus. I'm not, I'm not safe. I forgot Kenny. Uh, I'm sorry about that. You know, I used to be a teacher. And I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may take a little time. But that's just how these things work. I'd say like Everything four years, fine. then they graduate. Listen, relationships are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. What do you say? Will you help me work on them? The two of us must unify our factions for the common good. You know, like Churchill and Roosevelt. They say the world is over, but it's serious side serious. It's not. People are more political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? <coughs> well, we have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. My partner Matthew is a massive. This motherfucker about to give me homework. I think you'll like him. In any case, the point is. As long as we have our wits about us, we can always make the right choice. Right? Wasn't Lee? Lee was a, a teacher too, huh? Right. I, I, I stopped. I, <laughs> What's the matter, Clementine? Nobody was saying. Is there saying. something you want to tell me? I don't know you. You can talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. I'm just worried about the people chasing us. You're safe now. 
don't worry. Matthew will be back soon, and everything will be fine. Hey, kids, what are you two talking about? Oh, politics. The hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just gonna check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. What the fuck is that? Miss? Please, do you I ain't gonna lie, she looks familiar, okay? and I thought that I she saw the was. House and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss? Bonnie. Walt, I don't know. You're just gonna let her in like that? It's fine, Kim. Oh, we don't know wait. this girl. Then we'll have to get to days? Know. Right, Clem? Was she in 400 days? Walt, how much damage can this poor woman do? Check her for weapons. Yeah. Thank you. Really, yeah. but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you, then. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. I have a little girl like you. How old are you, sweetie? Am I tripping? <laughs> None of your business. I'm sorry. I didn't mean nothing by it, hon. Oh, yeah, yeah. She was the one with the, uh, she was the, <laughs> she was the one <laughs> with the whole Here you love are, triangle miss. shit. This is too much. Don't mention it. Yeah, I don't know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. Lot. You stay safe. You too. You're telling me that she's going to... One, her by herself. Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. <laughs> that is not the move there, Walter. Clementine. Don't freak out. I'm freaking out. Listen, okay, I gotta tell you something. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. No. Matthew. See, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. Now they're all worried he's not back yet. What are we gonna do? I don't know. I don't think Walter knows yet, so we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. We should tell him. He's gonna ask who did it, and you're gonna tell him. It's the right thing to do. It's right to get Nick killed because that's what's gonna happen. Now, do you, uh, you still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay, well, go get rid of it. I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and, uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right I like here. this, bro. What's up? Oh my god, loud ass, bro. Oh, uh, it's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. You coming to tuck me in? We have to tell you something. Hey, if there's something going on, I think if I Nick know. knows, he might fess up no, just on his own. Go back to bed, Nick. I'm serious. That way, you guys can talk to me. It's him. Cause I'm tired of I'm tired of secrets, bro. Oh Jesus! Oh God! God damn it! Hey, Nick, shut the fuck up. I can't, man. I can't. Do not fucking blow it. Blow it? It's over. I have to tell him, Luke. What? No, you can hey, Nick, you cannot do that. Are you fucking nuts? I gotta. I can't live with that on me. Okay, I hear you, but f I mean, fuck, man. Do you know what he's gonna do? You should tell him. Yeah, yeah. Nick, I'm warning you. This is fucking suicide. I'll live with it. Jesus Christ. Jesus. I can't handle this. Look, Clem, just wake go up do dead. that thing. All right. Like, honestly, bro, this is not something that I need to be holding on my conscience. Oh, 
It's gone. Why is he inspected? <laughs> this knife seems familiar. Same sharpness. Are you okay? I always like this knife. Where the hell did you get a smoking habit? Gave it to Matthew when all this started. I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier, something about shooting a man. You didn't already told him, so. I could see it. I could see it on his face. Wasn't sure then, but now? Can I stay quiet? It was us. It was our fault. Jesus. I, um... I don't feel good. Nick shot him. I really wanted Nick to be the one to say it! <laughs> now it looks like I'm... snitching. Is, uh... Is Nick a good man? Or is he just like everyone else? Is he just one of those, uh, those fuckers who don't give a shit about anyone but themselves? He is. He's a good guy, Walter. <laughs> he saved my life. <laughs> he was always going out alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? Do you need to tell him? Does he know? Tell him what? happened on the bridge. Tell me what you did. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, 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 thought, I thought he was going to shoot my friends, and I I shot Matthew. But it, 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 it happened real fast. I didn't, I didn't know if I hit him, but I did, and I didn't mean to. you know what you've done to me? Do you have any idea? I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. Let me get ready because I got a QE. QE? Okay, thank you. It's music. Is that how wind turbines work? They just. Walt, what's going on? The storm's got it spinning out of control. That sound's gonna draw walkers. We gotta shut it down now. Nick, help me. Carry the guns. Guns? That thing's a damn dinner bell. You can do it, Cliff. Huh? The 
easiest solution there. Something ain't right. Yeah. It was dramatic for no reason. We don't have much ammunition. We gotta get back to the lodge. They're behind us! What the fuck? Should have been a headshot. Obviously, look another one. Times you don't weave the zombie, Clem. All right, <laughs> I got time. This is my first time using this. Shoot! What the fuck? Damn. Stabby, stabby. Give me a choice. Oh. Oh. All right. I think if we had done it this a little differently, that would have ended in the worst way. Get inside. Go. What the fuck? What the hell? <laughs> like, who the fuck got an AK? And Bonnie? Howdy, folks. Fucking you happy! Oh, oh, of course! Sarah! Sarah. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? Inside. It's you. Keep moving. Stupid. place, Bonnie? Power and everything. A lot of windows, though. It's fucking huge. Bill's gonna hate it. Now the rest of them could be anywhere. <laughs> Man. 
Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them too? By their perfect timing? Johnny, cover that window. That's a easy. <laughs> One time bomb into this bro. So. What is he wearing? So you chose to walk through my house, but you didn't want to walk around this. One. Listen, I'm only gonna ask you once. Where's Rebecca? Sarah, look at me. It's gonna be okay. Oh. Oh. Damn! Rebecca, our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. I know you're out there. Oh. And Alvin, and Luke. Is Alvin? And the girl. No. This is real simple. You want this over quick. You all play nice and show your faces. My dad, please. He'll kill him. No, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Back. The baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? We have to help Carlos. Only way to help him is to do what the man says. What about Luke and Kenny? Look at those guns. If we start shooting, and people are gonna die on both sides. Damn! Clem can sneak out. Find Luke. What the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him? Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please! We're going down there. He'll kill you. Fuck you. Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! Who are you talking to? <laughs> Clem, go get help. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. You don't know that. Say goodbye, Carlos. Don't look, Susie. Don't look. I'll find Luke and Kenny. Stay here. God damn it. Who's the transfer? Never oh, did listen. They hurry. They should be close. Let's see if I can get your attention. <laughs> Here's the thing, right? I know I'm going to look for Luke and Kenny, but like, if y'all need to make a decision, y'all need to make a decision, all right? Perfect spotter right now. God damn, it's dark. Can't see a fucking thing. Good for me. Okay, who the fuck just shoots one shot and is like, all right, I got him. Let's go. <laughs> Bruh. 
I told y'all. Nick and Kenny are the same. Told y'all. Make some weird decisions, man. I guess me saying... <laughs> Should have just said, don't you? Yes. No. Ah! Walt! Oh my god. <laughs> That's for our man. Now, I didn't want to do this. But you ain't leaving me much choice. I just don't understand why you would... I'm sorry I keep pausing. I just don't understand why you would shoot one person thinking that that was a good idea, Kenny. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. Or you can give up now. Your choice. Motherfucker. Perfect shot, bro. Come on now. You at the side of him. What do you think? Take it. Clamp. Oh my god. What the hell are you doing? He'll kill him. We can't just give up. Kenny, he'll I mean, keep doing this. Think about Sarita. We're coming out. What the fuck is Lou? Let's go. I fucking hate this bitch, bro. Look at shit, Luke? goddamn mercenary, bro. God. Uh. I cut and run, huh? Why am I not surprised? I regret everything I, I did you. in the 400 days of I warned you not to follow him. <laughs> Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home. As a family. All right, round them up. We're heading back to camp. This is some bullshit. Son of a bitch would have shot Walt no matter what we did. Well, I ain't going out like that. Not without a fight. Yeah, I know. The folks are sore over what happened. But let's remember, these are our brothers and sisters, and they all have a vital role to play in this community. They strayed from the flock, yeah. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. I don't mean we can't find it in our hearts look at me like to that. give them, knowing full well, those who choose not to accept our love. Surely wish to get out. The storm is on the way. You know what, man? You know what, bruh? Tired of y'all putting all this damn pressure on a damn eleven-year-old, man. This is a lot. This is a lot of pressure. There's a lot of pressure, and there's a lot of decisions that y'all are forcing on an eleven-year-old. And I, you know, I I don't stand for it. Okay, I don't stand for it. All right. And on top of that, if I make the wrong decision, y'all didn't. Y'all y'all blame me. You know, I'm really, I'm really, um, I'm really interested in 
continue in the next season in the next episode so expect expect the next episode uh, uh episode three to be posted shortly after episode two uh the next day probably because i i am i am invested right now and i <laughs> yeah bro um I, no rants no rants though i'm not ranting on this one uh if y'all made it this far in the video though thank y'all thank y'all uh, hope y'all enjoyed it um hope y'all enjoyed episode two uh we'll see y'all in in the next episode right? if you want to see the next episode and you're not subscribed then do that it's free and like the video and comment <laughs> Thank y'all for watching, man. I will see y'all in the next episode. Love y'all.